Hello everybody. Here I am with the next part of the grass tutorial. This time we are going to make tree with collision. In this video we are going to see how we can create a vast forest full of trees in just a few minutes. So before watching this video I really suggest to watch the previous video and learn the concept behind the grass. I put the link of that video in the video description. So let me ask this question. What I can make with the grass system in m plugin? The answer to that is everything. When you put the mesh inside grass, it does not complain about that. You can also add collision to that mesh easily, which in this video we are going to discuss about that. You can create tree, rocks, house, cities, castle, everything you can imagine. But there is a limitation to this system. The main limitation is that you cannot control the exact position and rotation of your mesh. You can control the randomness somehow, but you cannot define the exact position or rotation of your mesh. The reason for that is because this system is designed to create millions of grass randomly. And there is no space for keeping the information for position, rotation, or scale. If we want to create a system which we can define the exact position, rotation, and scale, we should design from base another system, which maybe in future I will think about that. It is possible to create also that system. Everything is possible. Before adding the tree to scene, let me show you three different level of detail for tree which I created for tree. Here tree in left is for LOD0 which has the highest resolution among others. The middle one is decimated version of the tree. I removed its branches and this also has much less leaf. And the right one is tree which is really far away and it is just a billboard texture. By the way, the billboard texture in a special material is not good. I just created a video about how to make a good billboard material, which I suggest to watch that. There is one important thing about the tree mesh. As we are going to copy and paste this tree thousands of times, also we are going to modify the scale and rotation of this tree so it looks like this is another tree. You should design a very general tree which exists on our planet. Your tree should not have a special branch or some sign that show this tree is copied and pasted. It should be something general. So before adding collision in grass system, let's create and test a collision shape here. So for this tree, I am going to use a cylinder collision shape. Here, I just adjust that a little so it's covered around the tree. One important thing about the collision shape is that when tree randomly positioned, rotated, and scaled, the collision shape also do all of this stuff except scaling. The reason behind this is that as we scale the collision shape, it is not to behave good. Godot physics system is not good with a scaling collision shape. So here you just put a little bit more space for collision shape. So when tree get scaled, the player won't go inside the tree. Also see how much offset you need to apply. Well, now let's go and add our tree to train. Just under train, add a new grass node and set its mesh and material. Create a grass data for that. For tree, just select a big cell density. I just set that to 16. This means the train will divide it into the cell of 16 meter by 16 meter, and that is more than enough for tree. If you want less tree concentration, you can even increase that. Well, now if I restart train, I can paint some tree but they are not randomized. Let's randomize them. Create a LOD setting and save that. Set all of other LOD to this LOD setting. So the main difference between tree and grass is this. We don't want to change the number of the tree further away from the player. 
we change only the mesh of the tree so set force LOD count to zero so all of the LOD will have the same number of the tree now let's randomize our tree okay you can see sometimes some tree will have this problem to solve this problem set a negative offset value in y direction now it is okay so let's add collision to tree let me move to the position of the player before adding collision let me solve one problem basically i don't want to rotate the billboard texture of the tree because if I rotate that, it will not work properly. So go to LOD setting, and as you know, from LOD2 to above, we use billboard texture. So I make that unique, and then I apply that to other. So here, just don't change anything, because if you change them, a different random number will be generated. But we want the same random number for all LOD. Just remove randomization for rotation. Okay, well, now three far away look much better. Now, if I run my game, there is no collision. Just add the collision shape that we made L real and offset that with the current amount. And run the game again. Oh, you can see the collision shape need a little bit more adjustment. For now, we cannot escape a lot of our tree because the collision shape will not adjust itself. But the important thing is that we can create thousands of tree with collision. And this was about tree with collision, but you can use it for anything else also. So if you have any question, put that in the comment section. And till the next video, have a good time.